We have some breaking news tonight at 6. The Missouri Supreme Court is reversing Governor Parson's Medicaid ruling, siding with supporters of Medicaid expansion. Also, the ABC 17 storm track weather teams issued a weather alert day ahead of some dangerously warm temperatures expected to hit mid-Missouri this weekend. We will have storm track chief meteorologist Jessica Hafner breaking down that forecast in just a moment. But first, we have ABC 17's Zach Boetto live here in studio after speaking with an attorney who represented the plaintiffs. And Zach, that attorney says the decision is a big win for people of Missouri. Deb, Lucas, those who fought for this outcome tell me this win feels euphoric. With the decision, 275,000 Missourians will be eligible for Medicaid under this expansion. The court, in its unanimous 14-page decision, sent the case back to Cole County Circuit Court and instructed the judge to enter a judgment in favor of those who sought expansion of the program. Here's what one attorney who fought for the expansion had to say about the decision. I'm very appreciative of the court, not just for uh, ruling with us, but for expediting the case because we do want to get these folks covered under Medicaid. Now, on the other side, a spokesperson for the Missouri Attorney General's office, which argued in court against expansion, said the office will not comment because the case is ongoing. And the Supreme Court's ruling has received some comments from conservative lawmakers and groups. State Senator Dan Hedgeman spoke out opposing the decision in a statement. He called the move, quote, disappointing, saying the Constitution gives a General Assembly the power to determine state spending. Conservative group Americans for Prosperity also released a statement opposing the ruling. The group says the move could set Missouri back financially, saying the ruling fails Missourians. 